Good, yeah, good to get out there today, you know, just start moving around, get the body going, you know, after a trip down here. Tennessee, uh, how do they look on offense? What, they, they run really fast offense, obviously, so what is that, what challenges does that present? Yeah, it's going to put a challenge on us, you know, we definitely have to, you know, get the call, get out there, get lined up, ready to go, and that's kind of what we've been practicing the past couple of weeks, and so, um, you know, they've got a lot of talent offensively, too, so it, it's going to come up down to us, you know, doing the right things uh, mentally and physically. You may not even know this, but they announced that their freshman is going to be their starting quarterback, Joe Milton, out of the whole game. Oh, he did? Yeah. Yeah, they, we didn't even know that, firstly, yeah. but... Yeah. Whoever, uh, I guess, whoever the quarterback is, then, you know, we've, we've got to be ready to go. And they're still going to be running the same stuff, probably. And, you know, we'll uh, be able to execute you, so we got to be ready to go. Do you know much about, have you guys looked at that freshman quarterback at all? or? Not a whole lot. No, this is news to me today, yeah. to be honest with you. So um, They just announced it while you were out in practice. Yeah, so. there you go. So, so obviously, we're going to have to go back and take a look. So. Sure. What does that do? Phil, what, is that, what do you think the wheels are turning for Phil when he says, oh, guys, there's a freshman quarterback going against my defense? What does that mean? Yeah, I think it's uh, you know it's certainly different you know if you're if you're going against a guy that's a little bit more experienced mm -hmm. um, you know but at the same time um, obviously if he's going to be starting you know in a bowl game or, or you know a matchup you know he's from the SEC or Big Ten that he's obviously ready to go you know yeah. and he's good, he was a good high school player as well so so we're just going to yeah. have you given any more thought to your decision that you're going to have to make. Uh, no, not yet. No, just kind of wait until after the bowl game, I guess. You know, to, to finally make a decision. Who do you talk to? Are you feeling pressure? I don't feel any pressure. Coaches have, uh, you know, been real, real transparent with me, and, and you know, I can ask them any questions. Or, but really, I'll, I'll probably sit down with my parents at some point too. I've been talking to them a lot and make a decision. Did Jay's decision influence you at all? I mean, maybe a little bit, you know. But uh, I mean, it's good for the Hogout program, you know, to get Jay back. Obviously, you know, one of the best talents in the nation. Still guys. So. In what way did that? In a good way or a bad way, affecting your decision? You said. It might have affected your decision a little bit. Well, if I were to come back, it'd be nice to have Jay. Back, okay, gotcha. You know? yeah. So, um, I mean, you know, any chance um, he gets to play with guys like that, you know, it's certainly special. So. Um, Nick got cleared, so he could have an extra year. Has he talked about that with you guys? Are you guys all talking about what you're going to do? Uh, a little bit, you know. I mean, you know, no one really knows quite yet. I mean, if we all decisions, we'd all, you know, we'd have our mindset right now. But uh, I think we're all just kind of waiting, you know, until after the bowl game so we can focus on the bowl and, and be ready to go. Thank <laughs> you.